you know, families, all, all our families' contacts are on here. Because if somebody decides to take pictures of all these and starts, hey, where do you live? I, um, I don't know what the hell these people do with this, but I'm sure that my bank accounts, all that, I got to start changing. Mario, we're standing in your mother's bedroom, and this is a lot of her personal belongings that are scattered everywhere. Well, I feel like if the thieves went through it, why can't I at least start getting a piece of... My mother hasn't even had time to come through here. I know she's heartbroken, and this this is stuff that we've gathered amongst many years for it to be torn apart like this. And it, it really hurts. My, my personal possessions don't hurt as much because I still feel like I'm young, I can do this, but her belongings is what tears me up the most, to tell you the truth, is these are things that we work together so hard for my mother and for other people to come in here and destroy. This is my life, this is who I work for, and I, I'm really torn apart by this. When you left the house, you had no time, you just had to get out as quickly as you could, so, yes. and you were gone for how long? I was gone for two weeks, two Saturdays, and um, when I had to leave, I a friend of mine called me from work, and when I woke up from the hammock, the first thing I heard was the first bomber on Highway 175. And I told my stepdad, it's time to grab something. Let's get out of here. We have to go now. And when we got down there, we spent a few minutes looking at what was happening, trying to figure out how bad it was. Sheriff came up and said, you guys have to go now. And that's when we realized, okay, this is it. And this is what I come home to two weeks later. And when you came home and saw this, what were your feelings? When you open the door to find this. It's really sad in the sense of, I feel like somebody, all my personal, personal things, I feel so exposed. So like, you know, my deepest secrets, my deepest passwords, my things that nowadays we rely on those little passwords to keep things, your bank accounts, this and that. I just don't know where to start to tell you the truth. It's something that I plan to start with one room at a time and... Start putting things back, and I realistically don't even know what's, where to start, how to do it. But uh, as long as I keep moving forward, I went to work today, I called my mom, the insurance is coming over. So things are happening. I'm just a little, don't know how soon, don't know how fast things will be back to normal, if they'll ever make it that way. You know, it's, 